What's going on everyone? Thanks for clicking on the video and today we're gonna be talking about the big news coming out of the Pokemon Direct that just happened earlier today. Okay, so needless to say, I think that a lot of us were expecting some sort of a Pokemon Switch game announcement during the Direct. And we even assembled the Spawncast to do a quick predictions video on what we all thought would happen and pretty much all of us were on the same page about a proper Pokemon game finally coming to the Switch. But of course, I mean, we were all, we were, we were all wrong. Philip, what do you think's tomorrow, man? Um, I think we're definitely going to see some sort of Pokemon Switch related game, whether it's Pokemon Eclipse or Pokemon Stars. I think we're finally going to get that home console experience. But I also think that it's coming to the DS family as well, or the 3DS family as well. I do think it's going to be a Switch and a 3DS cross game like uh, we've been talking about. Except I did nail one prediction, but it just so happened to be kind of my worst fear about the whole thing. What if it's Pokemon Stars and it's just a 3DS exclusive? So Pokemon Stars or Eclipse or whatever we thought it would have actually been called is happening, but it's exclusively coming to the 3DS and that was what I was most afraid would happen because it's another step back and it's Nintendo missing the opportunity to debut the highly anticipated rumored Pokemon game on the Switch at the height of its excitement. It would have been perfect to have that moment. like. Literally historic to have a full-fledged Pokemon game come to the Switch. You know, even if it was just a better version of the 3DS game that we had released just last year, running at 60 frames per second and, you know, up to 1080p or 720p handheld. And of course, some bonus added content with, you know, extra Pokemon and maybe a couple extra storylines and, and all that stuff. But clearly, that's not the Pokemon Switch game that we ended up getting announced today. What did we get announced? We got Pokin Tournament, which is a Pokemon fighting game. And that's, it's actually kind of cool. And for those of you who don't know, it's essentially a fighting game that borrows a lot of its mechanics from the Tekken series. And it was originally released for Japanese arcades in July of 2015 and worldwide for the Wii U in March of 2016. So I'm a little disappointed that we're not actually getting the Pokemon game that I wanted, but we're still getting what looks to be a pretty good Pokemon game on the Switch overall. And with all these fighting games actually coming out on the Switch recently, I've been getting pretty into them, like the whole genre in general. And this one, it looks to be like pretty fitting. It looks cool. So if we are actually getting another fighting game on the Switch, especially this soon, it's coming out in August, guys, then does this mean that we're even that much further away from a Smash release coming to the Switch? Because they're just now releasing ARMS. It's coming out in just a few days, June 16th, which is a brand new IP that's a full-fledged fighting game coming from Nintendo and at the same time we're getting a Pokemon fighting game releasing just a couple months later in August where where's the room for smash I just I don't see it so we also got another cool micro announcement of Pokemon gold and silver coming to the 3ds virtual console which is cool if you want to kind of jump back into that whole series but I think it would have been also cool if we got a release of that on the switch but I'm pretty much assuming that they're just saving that for the actual announcement of Virtual Console on the Switch, which hopefully will happen at E3 this year. Oh, and last, we also got news that the Nintendo E3 Spotlight will only be 30 minutes long, and it's mostly gonna be covering unknown games, not focusing on ARMS and Splatoon 2. It's gonna premiere at 9 a.m. Pacific Time, followed by a 9.30 Pacific Time Treehouse event. So how do you guys feel about all the news coming out of the Direct today? Are you bummed that we're not getting a Pokemon Switch game, kinda like how we all sort of expected we would? Let me know in the comments below, you guys know I'm there all the time. Also, if you enjoyed the video, please remember to like it and subscribe for more Switch videos just like this one. Thanks and have a great day.